What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today me and my dad are out hunting bears again. Uh, it's the second weekend and uh, we're going to see if we can make something happen today. So we got we just got up here to our spot. We're going to hike up, start glassing. Um, on the way up here we saw a bear that was on private land. Um, so we kind of just stopped and I took a video of him. And it was pretty cool to see that. So bears are definitely out today. Uh, we're going to go hike up and uh, it's getting pretty warm so I'm going to put on some sunscreen and yeah if you guys want to subscribe down below that'd be awesome. So got my boots on we're about to get our packs on and get ready gonna start drinking this thing real quick never had one of these what do they call them mountain blaze, ups. blaze shot blaze energy and focus shots from mountain ups so this is the fresh pineapple flavor we're gonna drink a little bit of this got my sunscreen on shake well shake well get up there we were just glassing a little bit from from the truck um, but yeah we're gonna try to get up in there and see if we can spot a bear Ugh. Blech. that doesn't taste the best Ugh. Kind of gross. <laughs> I've tasted better ones. Mm. Uh, you just load it up with caffeine. Ah, fetch that, dude. It's like warm. I was expecting it to be like cold. That's 200 milligrams of caffeine. 200 milligrams? Well, I guess we're gonna be buzzing up this mountain. Elk. Elk. Up in there? That kind of round hill right there? Yeah, I get behind it. How, how do we access that? Just gotta go through here? Or like kind of like up and up around the back? There's a trail that you can actually get on that leads around and back into there. And it just goes down through these, through this right here? Yeah, I think, I think it just goes down through that creek bottom and up and around. Oh. Uh, we'll have to check that out at some point. All right, guys, we're making our way up the mountain. We started hiking, and uh, it's getting friggin' hot already, but we should be good to go. We're hiking up with our peaks trekking poles, of course, sissy sticks. If you guys want to get yourself a pair of trekking poles at peaks, go to peaksequipment.com, use code Brandon for 10% off. They're freaking awesome. Okay, so we just got to a point where we're just gonna sit here and start glassing. Um, there's two faces that we're kind of just sitting here and watching. Um, we're hoping that a bear will just be able to come out, but at this point, it's just a waiting game and we just gotta sit here and, and keep looking for them. So uh, that's how bear hunting goes, but. Heat of the day. Mm -hmm. It's gonna take Probably a couple hours before these bears start moving again. Yeah. In the exact same spot, and then finally you just see them. Really? Yeah. I think at any moment they could like just pop out of like these trees right there, you know? Yeah. And just come up because there's kind of like a backside to them that you can't really see. Yeah. Each of these spines that kind of comes down has a backside where it's shaded. Right. Those bears are gonna hang out in that shaded stuff. You know, just sleep in a bed. Like the middle of the day, like right now when it's hot, they'll just kind of hunker down. They'll start to come out when it starts to cool a little bit. Just start moving. Do you, see, do you think there's anything kind of on that face over there or what? Super green. I think Ryan Lampers 
calls that chartreuse. Chartreuse. That's what you want. Beat him. What's up, guys? So, we've been glassing for about two hours now. Um, not seeing a whole lot right now but it's kind of the middle of the day and it's and it's hotter so we're thinking that they're going to come out in a little bit for for the evening once it cools down but uh, we're sitting out here right now i'm getting pretty hungry dad's kind of chowing down on all of his, all of his food but um, i'm going to make a cold cereal from peak refuel strawberry granola i brought some cold water in a hydro flask and I'm gonna get to eating that and we're just gonna keep watching um, on these mountainsides and see if anything pops out but we're thinking it's gonna be probably another couple hours before a bear starts coming out if it's if it's around here so I'm gonna get to eating and we're just gonna keep looking at these mountains or keep glassing so. find out so still has some ice in here so we're gonna try to this is gonna be interesting Maybe a little more got some ice chunks in there keep it extra cold it's kind of cooled down we have that nice breeze so we'll let that sit for about five minutes and then we'll get to eating it that's cold you can feel how cold that is really yeah <laughs> all right let's sit been about five minutes so we're gonna break it open it's still freaking cold I think I put a little bit too much water it's kind of sloshing around in there but it's gonna be good either way so let's try it out mmm that's some pretty good stuff peak refuel really got their crap together dude I think my favorite uh, meal that they make is definitely their chicken pesto pasta. I think their chicken pesto pasta is superior to all other. Should I say that? Probably not. Yeah, you should. Okay, yeah, I think they are. Superior to all other dehydrated meals. But if you have to settle for like back, uh, backpacker's pantry or mountain house, you gotta do what you gotta do but Peak Refuel is the way to go. They're not sponsoring this video or anything, but uh, that's my honest opinion. Peak Refuel, that's what my choice is. I'm pretty good. in of glassing and uh, still nothing we haven't seen anything yet it's kind of gotten a little chillier and the temperatures dropped a little bit which is good and we're hoping that a bear will be coming out soon we're gonna stick around for probably another hour hour and a half or so um, and keep just glassing because that's all we can do at this point 
Um, but yeah, if, if nothing shows up in the next hour and a half, then we're probably going to head out of here because it'll be too late to shoot by the time we get to it. But I just keep eating, keep snacking on stuff. Right now I'm about to eat this chewy granola bar and then some fruit snacks. Gotta stay, keep the calories going. Um, even while you're out here on the mountain, you gotta keep your calories in so that you can keep your energy up. And then brought a bunch of extra water and so I'm not running low on any water, but uh, yeah, so all we can do right now is kind of just keep glassing, hope something turns up, and uh, we'll see how it goes. Alright guys, so we're headed out of that spot for the day. We glassed for quite a few hours and uh, never saw anything, so we're just heading out, hiking out right now. Next weekend, or I guess here in a few days, we're gonna be trying a new spot where we've killed a bear before. And uh, hopefully we're gonna have some better luck there. We might do an overnight trip in a few days in that spot and uh, hopefully make something happen. Bear season's coming to an end here pretty soon, but we're still hopeful and I think, I think in the next few days we're going to be able to get it done so uh thank you guys for watching if you guys want to subscribe down below that would be awesome and uh we'll see you next time